An apparent whistleblower report was pretty blunt, calling plane maker Boeing's production system a rambling, shambling disaster waiting to happen. Oh, that should make you feel calm if you're getting on a plane. <laughs> well, the report claims the company is entirely responsible for this month's midair blowout on an Alaska Airlines flight. Hannah Batal live at DFW Airport with these eye-opening details. Hannah. Good morning, Brandon Lauren. Yeah, that whistleblower not mincing words there. And Boeing has faced scrutiny for years now about its quality control practices. Well, that scrutiny has only intensified after this month. A door plug blew off of one of its planes mid-flight. The NTSB, which is still investigating the incident, says all four of the, the screws that were meant to hold that plug in place, the bolts were missing. The apparent whistleblower told the New York Times and the Seattle Times Boeing staff is to blame, saying they were the last to work on that door plug and that the work was not inspected before the plane was delivered to Alaska Airlines. The door plug came off during a flight January 5th, leaving a hole in the fuselage. Plane made an emergency landing. Boeing has not responded to the reports, but its CEO says the company is focused on inspections of its grounded MAX 9 aircrafts. He spoke to reporters after a closed door hearing on Capitol Hill yesterday. We believe in our airplanes. We field safe airplanes. Our people do. We have confidence in the safety of our airplanes. And that's what all of this is about. And we fully understand the gravity. Boeing says that today it is planning to hold a stand down for production, delivery, and support teams to have learning sessions on quality. Federal regulators approved an inspection process for the door plugs on the planes that do remain grounded at this time. United and Alaska Airlines are the only two U.S. carriers that use them, and they'll only be out of service for a few more days. Alaska says it plans to return some of the MAX 9s to service on Friday, and United plans to get them back in the works starting Sunday. Live at DFW Airport, I'm Hannah Batoff for Good Day.